What's good producers, this is your man Jimmy Conway from InstantClassicProductions.com and in today's video I'm going to show you how to create a sign up form in your Aweber account. Okay, the first thing you need to do is go to your list that you want to create the sign up form for. Remember last video I showed you how to create a list uh, for, for five free trap beats? So that's what we're going to be giving away. When I say giving away five free trap beats, I mean tag beats. I don't mean untagged beats. We're giving away five free tag beats for demo purposes. So click the uh, once we go to a current list, five free trap beats, click the sign up form button. Here they have a little video about subscribing uh, and sign up forms. But here we're just going to click the green button here, create your first sign up form. And in here, you have a bunch of different options. You have different categories of sign up forms, pre made templates to get you started. You can go with whatever color theme fits you best. Up here they have popular. This is where you may want to start out. The one I like the most is this one here where it says download. So I'm going to click here. Here you can change the color scheme. So if you like uh, marine or peel or mono, you could choose those. Uh, I'm going to leave it on royal. I'm going to click load template. Okay, so here's my sign up form. All right, I can stretch it out, resize it, size it back. Up here is my header for the sign up form. When I click that, it will open up a text box. And that, in that text box, you can click with, uh, you can say whatever you want. So I'll just put, do you wrap? Download five free trap beats today and start recording now. Okay. Click save field. Actually, you know what? That looks a little small. So when I click back here, I'm going to highlight everything. Just click Control A. Here where it says font size, click here, and you can change the size of the text. And it kind of gives you like a good representation here. So I'm gonna go with 18 pixels. As you see, the text got larger here. Okay, click Save Field. Now here where it says name, I like to get a little bit deeper and say rap name okay so I'm gonna click here where it says full name just put click here in front of name and click rap rap name okay click save field now where it says email I like to say most checked email so they don't send it to like a bogus email so click email click the email tab here Click right in front of the email here and put most checked. Hit a space. Hit save field. Submit. I don't like that word. So I'm going to be a little bit more flashy. Say get your free downloads today. Okay. Now here you can click the X for the email privacy and for the power by Aweber or you can leave them if you want. It's your choice. I'm going to resize this a little bit. Okay. Click save field. And there you go. You can put something here in the footer also. You want to edit the footer. I'm not going to put anything there. So 
from here, I'm gonna click save your form. Go to step two. I'm gonna name my web form, just call it five free trap beats to keep everything congruent. Thank, the thank you page here, you can leave it on basic version or you could try out the audio version and the video version. They're all great. I currently use a custom page and in another advanced video, I'll show you how that works, okay? But you're gonna need your own website for that, okay? So from here, I'll just click save form. And go to step three. Guess what? We're done. Our sign up form is done. Now you have a couple of options here. Uh, the one you're probably going to use the most is either I will install my form or have Aweber host my form. I'm going to show you both, but I'm going to show you to have Aweber host my form first. If you click here, in the drop down, they're going to give you a link. You can simply just copy that link. Create a new tab, I'll paste that link here. Guess what? There's your sign up form. So you can send a rap artist to that page right there, that link, and have them sign up. And the great thing is, there's nothing else on this page to distract them from going elsewhere. There's no other links. It's either they're gonna leave their name and email here, or they're not. Okay, so that's the cool thing. Click this, exit out of here, go back to Aweber. Now I will install my form. This one you may need a website for, and you have to be a little bit comfortable with HTML coding. Uh, I'm a little comfortable with it. I've been doing it for a few years now, so I will go here, click here. Now this, you could just copy all of this code, Control A, and hit Control C or Command C. Now I'm gonna go to my website here, instantclassicproductions.com. I use a theme called the Music Maker theme, and they make it very easy for me to create new products and new things for my website. So I'm just gonna go here, create new posts, new blog posts. Actually, scratch that. We'll do a page. Let's do a new page. Okay. And then at the top of the page, we're going to say five free beats. Okay. Now, visual will let you see, you know, how your thing is going to look. I'll show you. I'll show you the difference. Hold on. Download five free trap beats today. Okay. I'm going to write that in the visual. Or I could have wrote that in the text. It doesn't matter. Now, that code that we just copied in Aweber, you want to click over here where it says text. There's a spot where it says visual and text. Click where it says text. Right below there, I'm going to hit Control V and paste my form. Now I'm going to go back to visual. It's not going to show it to me just yet until I publish the page. But I'm going to make this larger here. So let's go heading and I will center it. Okay. Done. Save. Sorry, it's taking a little long. Hit preview, see what it looks like. And here's how your sign up form could look on your website. Okay? Rap artists, you send the rap artist to your web page. Actually, no. Let me do it like this. Put this out here. 
I'm not gonna do a preview. I'm gonna actually publish the page so you can actually see what your page will look like. Hit publish. The page I was showing you before was a preview page. Now this page is actually actually published to the public. Public. Published to the public. There we go. Uh, hit view page. Second. Now right here it says instantclassicproductions.com slash five free beats. Okay. okay. Now you can just send the artist here and they'll sign up or they won't. Uh, but now your sign up form is on your website. Okay. If you have any other questions, you can leave them in the comments below. Please like and subscribe if you like the content I've given you. And uh, in the part three. I'm going to show you how to create a string of emails that artists will get once they sign up to your sign up form here. So when artists sign up here, you can create two kind of emails for them. You can create broadcasts which go out to all your artists or you can create what's called, um, let's go back to AWeber real quick. Go to messages. It's called the Legacy Follow Up Series. Okay. So, just to break it down, I'm going to go to another list that I have that's a little bit more established. So, my 15 free beats over here. So, when artists were signing up to, I don't use this list anymore. So, it's, a, it's kind of like an older list. When artists used to sign up to my 15 free beats, they would get an email right off the bat from me that would give them their 15 free beats. So if I go to Legacy Follow-Up Series, they would get this string of emails all within a certain amount of days apart. You can set how many days apart they are. So you can set two days apart, four days apart, send an email a week, send an email every two weeks, however you want to do it. But the first email they would get would be open your, uh, get your 15 free beats here. They would click that. There would be a link inside there where they could download their 15 free beats. But then down the line, you could just politic with them, ask for their social media stuff, hit them with some good content, like, you know, how to build their brand and stuff like that. And, you know, once in a while, I'll slide them with, you know, a sale here and there. And then, that way you can start selling some beats. So... I'll show you how to create a legacy, uh, a legacy follow-up series in the next e uh, in the next video. Okay. This is your man Jimmy Conway. Please like and subscribe and comment below if you have any questions. All right. This is your man Jimmy Conway. Instantclassicproductions.com. Peace out. One love.